In the realm of television, certain actors etch their mark with a singular role, attaining iconic status despite a relatively modest body of work. Tempest Bledsoe epitomizes this phenomenon, securing the role of Vanessa Huxtable at the tender age of 11, a portrayal that would define her career. Throughout the 1980s, Bledsoe embodied the image of adolescent and teenage black girls, becoming an enduring representation. Vanessa, the virtuous member of the Huxtable family, distinguished herself with stellar academic performance and an unwavering commitment to familial bonds. Her penchant for engaging in family gossip, particularly when siblings were involved, added depth to her character. Bill Cosby, the architect of The Cosby Show, consistently emphasized the series' intention to depict a household where parental authority prevailed, a departure from the prevailing trend of sitcoms skewed towards the perspectives of children who often outsmarted clueless adults. Amidst this landscape, Tempest Bledsoe's portrayal of Vanessa Huxtable stands out for her adeptness in comedic timing and repartee. Her ability to hold her own against the seasoned performances of Bill Cosby and Felicia Rashad remains indelibly etched in our memories, showcasing her remarkable comedic prowess. By the close of 2023, Tempest Bledsoe boasts a net worth of $6 million. Born on August 1, 1973, in Chicago, Illinois, Bledsoe's journey into the entertainment world commenced early, driven by a childhood passion for acting. Her foray into the industry began at the age of four, modeling for various projects. Notably, she featured in commercials for household names like Kellogg's and Safeway. The pivotal moment in her career arrived at the age of nine when she auditioned for a role on The Cosby Show, the brainchild of the renowned comedian Bill Cosby. Following a successful audition, Bledsoe secured the role of Vanessa Huxtable, the fourth child in the Huxtable family on the hit TV show, The Cosby Show. At just 11 years old, she made her debut on the small screen in 1984, marking the beginning of an eight-season journey as a series regular until the show's conclusion in 1992. The Cosby Show, airing on NBC's Thursday nights, achieved remarkable success, clinching the coveted number one spot in television ratings for five consecutive seasons, an achievement shared by only one other show in the history of Nielsen ratings. Throughout its entire run, spanning eight seasons, the show consistently ranked among the top 20 rated programs on television, showcasing its enduring popularity. Beyond its exceptional ratings, The Cosby Show played a crucial role in breaking barriers and fostering diversity in television. The show's success paved the way for a broader spectrum of programs featuring predominantly black casts, including iconic series like In Living Color and The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. It even served as the inspiration for the spin-off series, A Different World, which delved into the college experiences of Denise Huxtable, Vanessa's character, and her friends. Bledsoe herself made a guest appearance on A Different World, adding to the show's cultural significance. While captivating audiences as Vanessa Huxtable on The Cosby Show, Tempest Bledsoe seamlessly embraced a variety of acting roles and television appearances, showcasing her versatile talent. In 1985, she made notable appearances as herself in NBC Special Treat, Andy Williams and the NBC Kids Search for Santa, and One to Grow On. These engagements not only highlighted her on-screen presence but also demonstrated her ability to connect with audiences in different settings. The following year, in 1986, Bledsoe expanded her repertoire by taking on the role of Grace Wheeler in the 15th season of the ABC After School Special program. Displaying her acting prowess in diverse genres, her versatility was further evident as she graced the iconic Hollywood squares, making appearances in both 1986 and 1988. This exposure solidified her status as a familiar and engaging personality beyond the confines of scripted television. Bledsoe's journey continued to unfold in 1988 when she secured a role in the television film, Danced Till Dawn, and made a memorable appearance in an episode of Monsters. The following year, in 1989, she portrayed the character Danny Fairview in the television film, Dream Date, showcasing her ability to bring depth to diverse roles. Adding to her accomplishments, Bledsoe assumed the character of Vanessa Huxtable in the 1990 Earth Day special, reaffirming her connection to the beloved character that had endeared her to audiences. Simultaneously, her commitment to social causes became apparent when it was announced that she would serve as a national spokesperson for the D.A.R.E. organization in 1989. Demonstrating her dedication to making a positive impact beyond the entertainment realm. Following the conclusion of The Cosby Show in the spring of 1992, 
Tempest Bledsoe ventured into a new role as the host of her own daytime talk show, The Tempest Bledsoe Show. Airing for a single season from 1995 to 1996, the show aimed to provide a unique perspective, drawing on Bledsoe's youth, recent college experience, and her identity as an African-American woman. Bledsoe expressed her distinctive viewpoint, stating, There are lots of things that come together that make me different. We talk about relationships that we all have in common, like mothers and fathers and boyfriends and girlfriends. Everybody can get something out of it. The series, often aired alongside another daytime talk show, Ricky Lake, which shared a focus on relationships and family issues, faced challenges in the competitive world of daytime television. Despite Bledsoe's sincere efforts and unique approach, her show struggled to match the ratings of Ricky Lake. Unfortunately, the series was cancelled after being on the air for less than a year, marking the end of Bledsoe's stint as a daytime talk show host. After her stint as a talk show host, Tempest Bledsoe continued to make her mark in television, taking on guest roles in popular sitcoms such as The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air and The Parkers. She also showcased her acting prowess in dramas like The Practice and Strong Medicine. Venturing into the realm of reality TV, Bledsoe embraced the challenge as a contestant on VH1's Celebrity Fit Club. Shedding 19 pounds and adopting a vegetarian lifestyle during the show, speaking to People magazine, she emphasized her approach to health, stating, For me, what works best is to try and eat healthy and not worry about the scale. Undeterred by the challenges of reality television, Bledsoe, along with her husband Daryl M. Bell, entered the world of unscripted entertainment in the series, House Husbands of Hollywood. The show focused on families where wives took on the role of breadwinners. Bledsoe, reflecting on her experience, noted, It was something that a friend of mine was producing, and I was like, why not let's try it? But I'm a little too private for that, so it's not my forte. The genre is just so huge at this point and can be so many different things. It's just another way to communicate with an audience, but as far as talking about my private life and stuff like that, it's not my thing. Following her stint on the reality series, Clean House, in 2010, Tempest Bledsoe made a notable return to primetime television the next year with the NBC sitcom, Guys With Kids. Marking her regular role after a two-decade hiatus, the show, centered around three men navigating parenthood with their partner's support, featured Bledsoe alongside Anthony Anderson. Regrettably, the sitcom faced a premature end, lasting only one season and being cancelled after airing 17 episodes. Maintaining a lasting connection with her former co-stars from The Cosby Show, including Bill Cosby, Bledsoe acknowledged Cosby's significant role in safeguarding her from the challenges often faced by child actors. Reflecting on her childhood, she emphasized, between him and my mom, there were no better examples. The focus was always on having a healthy childhood. Notably, Bledsoe stands out as one of the few cast members who has refrained from publicly addressing the allegations surrounding Cosby. While some cast members, such as Felicia Rashad, have expressed support for Cosby, Others like Keisha Knight Pulliam and Malcolm Jamal Warner have defended the show's legacy while maintaining a distance from the individual. In a revealing 2011 interview with People magazine, Tempest Bledsoe provided a glimpse into her personal life. In 1993, her personal life took a significant turn when she began dating actor Daryl M. Bell, her co-star from the NBC comedy, A Different World. Their connection, forged in the realm of television, blossomed into a lasting relationship. Over the years, the couple has shared the spotlight on multiple occasions, notably in the Fox Reality Channel series, House Husbands of Hollywood, which premiered in August 2009. Beyond her romantic relationships, Bledsoe has maintained enduring friendships from her time on The Cosby Show, notably with her former co-star Pam Patillo. This attests to the lasting bonds forged during their shared television journey. Additionally, Bledsoe's personal commitment to health and fitness shines through, as she has embraced a vegetarian lifestyle. This aspect of her life reflects a broader interest in well-being that complements her thriving career. In more recent years, Bledsoe's roles have included the Lifetime original movie, Jingle Bell, alongside Tatiana Alley, and a guest appearance on the Netflix sitcom, Family Reunion, in 2019. Notably, Vanessa Huxtable, the character Bledsoe portrayed, became an inspirational figure for young black children growing up, leaving a lasting impact through her portrayal on television. With great success achieved and assets of $6 million.
It won't come as a surprise that we're taking you on a tour of her incredibly luxurious villa right now. Mansion in Chicago In 2011, Tempest Bledsoe made a wise investment in a beautiful house located in Chicago, purchasing it for a sum of $1,400,000. The property sits on a generous land area spanning 3,100 square feet, offering ample space for comfortable living. This exquisite villa, constructed in 2006, showcases modern architecture characterized by clean lines and a minimalist design. The house is a testament to luxury, boasting top-notch finishes throughout. Situated in the sought-after Noble Square area, this three-story dwelling is strategically designed for a seamless blend of living, entertaining, and working in the vibrant backdrop of one of Chicago's most lively neighborhoods. Upon entering the house, the first floor unfolds into the main living space, serving as the heart of the home. The living room, spacious and inviting, easily accommodates a large dining table, setting the stage for gatherings and family meals. The kitchen, a masterpiece in itself, exudes class and magazine quality appeal. Equipped with state-of-the-art smeg appliances, including double built-in refrigerators that complement sleek flat panel designs, the kitchen is a culinary haven. A built-in dishwasher and a 36-inch gas stove add both artistic flair and functional efficiency to the cooking space. The internal stairs within the house lead to a rooftop retreat, offering panoramic skyline views, an indulgence that adds a touch of luxury in a city where space is often a prized commodity. This rooftop haven becomes an entertainment hub with easy access to a bar, complete with a prep sink and refrigerator, a perfect setting for hosting gatherings or enjoying quiet evenings under the stars. Descending downstairs, a large family room awaits, equipped with a counter, sink, cabinets, and yet another refrigerator, enhancing the functionality and versatility of the space. The fourth bedroom and an adjacent full bathroom on this level provide an ideal arrangement for a guest room, home office, or a dedicated space for teenagers. The inclusion of a two-car garage completes the practical aspects of this well-rounded home. Beyond its physical attributes, the location of this property is truly unbeatable. Situated just steps away from the renowned Eckhart Park, residents can enjoy the amenities of a clubhouse, indoor pool, baseball field, walking, jogging trails, and open green spaces, a perfect blend of urban living and recreational opportunities. Additionally, the house is conveniently located, with a 10-minute walk to the Chicago Avenue Blue Line stop, providing easy access to transportation. Its proximity to the 9094th Expressway and the vibrant Chicago Avenue ensures that residents are well connected to top-notch restaurants and entertainment options. The cherry on top is the tranquil setting of the house on a quiet, tree-lined one-way street, offering a peaceful retreat amidst the urban hustle. In a noteworthy development, Tempest Bledsoe contemplated selling the house in early 2023. However, she later reconsidered, opting to rent the property for $9,000 per month a decision that adds an intriguing chapter to the story of this remarkable home. Philanthropy and Business Beyond her successful acting career, Tempest Bledsoe has proven herself to be a savvy businesswoman, engaging in a variety of ventures that have significantly contributed to her wealth. One notable aspect of her financial acumen is her wise investments in stocks and real estate, showcasing a strategic approach to building and diversifying her financial portfolio. In addition to her investments, Bledsoe has ventured into entrepreneurial pursuits, including product endorsements and partnerships. Beyond the realm of business, Tempest Bledsoe is recognized for her philanthropic efforts, actively participating in charitable work and supporting causes close to her heart. This commitment not only makes a positive impact on the world but also adds to her reputation as a socially responsible individual. Furthermore, engaging in philanthropy has the dual effect of increasing her net worth as her involvement in charitable causes resonates positively with the public. An additional source of income for Bledsoe comes from her endorsement deals with various brands. These partnerships not only bring in a significant amount of income but also contribute to her overall wealth. The strategic selection of brands aligns with her image and values, creating a mutually beneficial relationship that enhances both her financial standing and the brand's market presence. Her ability to navigate both the business and philanthropic spheres not only underscores her financial success but also positions her as a well-rounded personality with a positive impact on society. Thank you for watching the entire video. Leave us your comments in the section below. We hope you have found this helpful video. Don't forget to leave a like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you like it. 
Thank you for watching this, and see you in the next videos. Goodbye.